Fire is an integral part of the Blue Mountains landscape. At this location, fire has recently killed a number of trees. You can see the dead branches have been cut. These are gum trees called the Blue Mountain Ash or Eucalyptus aureates. In this view you see one of the trees before it was cut. See the bare grey branches with no leaves or flowers. The fire was lit by an arsonist. Follow their trunks down and you will see there is no bark left at all. It has broken off the trunk and fallen to the ground around the base of the trees. Now look closely at the tree trunk and observe the small bumps. These are the scars of the old branches called epicormic shoots. Gum trees respond to damage such as fire by growing these shoots to form new branches and leaves. Also see the vertical lines which are cracks in the tree trunk. These were caused by the fire which heated the outer bark of the tree. After the fire, the fruits of the gum tree, known as capsules or gum nuts, fall to the ground. Within days, the gum nuts have shed their seeds, spilling it onto the bare soil. There are tens of thousands of seeds scattered from each tree, most of which is quickly eaten by animals or collected and stored underground by ants. With the first rain after the fire, the gum tree seeds germinate and quickly grow, producing a dense cluster of seedlings near the remains of the killed trees. You will see many clumps of young trees in the fire affected area, most of which die within a few years. The most vigorous of them will outgrow all the others and dominate the area, once again becoming a tall blue mountain ash.